So. Good morning. Wait, can you introduce yourself? I'm Creighton, and, in case you didn't know. And I'm Mumsy, and I'm still in my pajamas, because what are we doing this morning? Um, I don't really know. Okay. Well, I'll put it on pause while you think about what you're going to tell me again, okay? I'll put it on pause. And I am, so I am doing, I, Mumsy was praying for 15 minutes, and I got two sticky notes, and now I'm going to write two verses, and the first one is Proverbs 22, 7. 23, 7. Wait, 23? Oh, See the yeah. big 23? I mean, 20, Proverbs 23, 7. You spent quite a lot of time while I, because when I pray, I put my fingers in my ears, and then I don't talk to my grandchildren when I'm praying, because I'm talking to Jesus. So Creighton spent a long time trying to find the book of Proverbs in the Bible while he was waiting patiently. And then he, and then what happened, Creighton? Uh, you had a runny nose, and then you said it. I'll do it now. <laughs> was I fussing when I was praying? I don't get what you mean. Was I crying? I don't think you were. My nose was running. Hey, we got good news today, too. Do you remember what our good news is? Um, so a person near Mumsy had Delta, and they got the test, and it happened two days ago. And they said that Mumsy didn't have Delta. Yay! So that means I don't have Delta. <laughs> yes. We're very excited. No Delta. Mm hmm Okay, is there anything else you want to tell us about the Bible or what you're doing? Mm -hmm. Where did you decide to look up Proverbs 23-7? Did you find it on this card? N no. I no. Didn't. You just read it until you found something? No. What happened? I just... So, since I found Proverbs 22, 4. Because um, that was the other card you were looking at? My yes. other manna? Okay. And, and then I decided just to find a random verse, and I didn't even turn the page in one single time, and then I just did um, Proverbs 23, 7. Were you reading the Bible? Yes. Oh, man. That's awesome. And guess what? What? The phone. So, in 10 days... I mean, seven days, it's my birthday, and, and I'm getting a Bible, a kid's Bible. Oh, Papa and I said we, we're going to see what kind of Bible. Maybe there's like a Minecraft Bible or a, like... My mom already ordered a Bible offline, but maybe I could have two Bibles. Oh, you see, she already ordered you one. Yes. Mainly, we just need one Bible that we actually read. What most, do you mean? Most Americans have like five Bibles, but they never actually read them. What do you mean? Well... Most people have Bibles on the shelf, but they never actually open it and read it. Uh, guys, you want to see the biggest book I've seen in the room I slept in for, um, until today? Yes. Do you want to have the This holy Bible right here. So big. Oh, let's get it out. This is the bookshelf. Look at all the Bibles we have. Mm -hmm. Okay. How old is that Bible? This was the Bible that that Papa's grandma had. Is it very, very old? It's very, very old. Would you like to open it? Sure. Oh, let's look under that. Well, whose picture is that? Do you know who that is? I'm going to guess, um, Papa. It is. It's Richard. How do I know? Yeah. It's a poor crushed flower. Yeah. All right. Let's see if we can find Proverbs 23 in here. Let's see if it, somebody filled it out properly. They didn't. Too bad. You're supposed to, this Holy Bible presented too. Aunt Tracy told me that this book was always on the coffee table and she loved the pictures. She There's loved. pictures? There are pictures in here somewhere. Whoops. Okay, well, let's go to Proverbs. Oh, oh there's another picture. Yeah. Oops, let's go to Proverbs. Psalms and Proverbs. Maybe, Psalms. what if we read this? Random note. There's probably a reason why it's in there. Oh, Lord. Oh, gosh. 
There's Jonah oh. and the whale. Uh, Looks like he... What is he even wearing? Doesn't look like he's wearing much, does it? No. <laughs> yeah. That's too much. He needs a bathing suit. Okay, let's read Proverbs 23. And you were writing what one? Proverbs 23. What number were you reading? Proverbs 23, 7. Oh. For as he thinketh in his heart, so is he. Eat, drink, saith he to thee, but his heart is not with you. This is called King James. And Mumsy doesn't care for it. Because we don't speak in old King. We don't speak in old English. And we were talking about it. I wonder if it says that word again. No, it doesn't say gluttony. This is what Mumsy has to think on. When you sit down to eat with a ruler, consider diligently what is before you. And put a knife to your throat if you be a man given to... It says appetite here, but the other one says gluttony. And what is gluttony, Creighton? Um, greedy. Greed. Yeah, Mumsy mm -hmm. is greedy. I'm working on it. Okay, so that's probably all we need to do for today. Can you look at me? Anything else you want to tell us? Not really. All right. Besides if um, you have time to, for me to show you that paper folding thing, Mommy. Oh, yeah, we better do that. Can you show us? The, let's put, we'll put it on pause while we put all this Maybe away. Maybe we can put this in here. That's a good idea. I'll put it on pause. No, it's the same video. I put it, it's the on-off method. Okay, wait. It's not a good view. Is this good? Okay, now I can see. What do you want to show us? Um, this, um, tumbling and the star thing now. Okay. It doesn't, it won't spin very well unless you do that. Okay, can you show it? And then it? this. It takes a, quite some time to actually get it into the Did you work board. on that all this morning? Uh, not all the morning. All for, it's not like a long, long time, but. It's a was long working, time to me. I Ooh. was working on it, at least. Were you doing that while I was still resting? Yes. Thank you for letting me sleep. That was very kind of you. What time, and, what time do you wake up in the morning? Uh, around at seven or maybe sometimes six. All right. Well, that's very cool. So it, like, you can move it different ways. It turns into that. And what's it called? Um, a magic star slash frisbee. And I'm tr trying to make up a good name to call it besides that because I think it's a bit too long. Hmm. Well, maybe if you have any suggestions, you can put in the comments what we should call it. Do you want to show them the book that you learned how to do that from? Did you read all the directions yourself? Uh, yes. Here it is. A lot of them. And do you read that book yourself? Mm -hmm. Pretty much. And can you follow the directions? Mm -hmm. Who can't? Uh, you, uh, you're, so since you said your brain doesn't really work that way, you know. Yes. Mumsy wanted to learn how to do origami, but when I read the directions, I can't understand it. Even though there's pictures, I still can't understand. Because Creighton has a different type of intelligence than Mumsy, don't you? Oh, do you see that? Oh. It's called a string of one hundred. 1,000 cranes. What? You made me a crane. I saved it. It's on the mm -hmm. dresser. Do you want to show them the crane? No. That you made? No, thank you. Well, I do. How is that 1,000 cranes? I don't get it. You'll have to read the whole thing. All right. I'm going to show them the crane, and then I'm going to conclude the video. This is the one, one crane that he made me a long time ago that I saved. With my dragon. Where is it? Right here. He lives with the dragon and the Legos. The kind of bird grain, you know. All right. Look at me. You want me to make it like? Look at the viewer. This is a conclusion of our 
informal video. Can you say goodbye? Goodbye. No, that's look at that's not a good ending. Bye. <laughs> bye. Okay, I'm gonna press a button. We'll buy a lot. Buy a lot. I hope you